Hey, it's Mark Coleman from Paul's Photo and the Creative Photo Academy and the lab at Paul's Photo. It's day 121 of our Be Creative series today, and I decided to try something different. You know, a couple of you have asked me, so Mark, how come you're not using a wide angle lens on any of your photos? And the reason why we've been shooting in the house, we've been staying close. What does a wide angle lens mean? A wide angle lens means a broad background, a large background. And when I'm shooting in the house, trying to keep control of everything, have the picture simple and meaningful, using a wide lens doesn't really go with that. But I saw a scene today. My wife and son were working on a puzzle. They've been doing puzzles the whole time we've been home. And they've got this great puzzle out. And I thought, that's a cool picture. I want to shoot that. But it meant a wide angle lens. Why? I've got the 14 to 30 lens here on the Nikon Z7. That's my favorite wide angle lens of all time. It's probably the best wide angle lens picture quality wise I've ever shot in my life, bar none. So what does the wide angle lens do? Makes the foreground big. So what you'll see the picture, I've got the puzzle in the foreground with the pieces kind of just like they left it. You know, my son's beers over there and just the whole scene, the chaos here, but it gives you a sweep, a grandeur of this picture. So that's why I used a wide angle lens to capture the puzzle, to capture the scene that's going on here. Now, I could have used a telephoto lens and come on in close for, for details, but that's not what I wanted. I wanted the scene. I wanted the atmosphere. I wanted the feeling of this. And the wide angle lens gave that to me. Learn your lenses. Know what a normal lens does, a wide angle lens and a telephoto lens. Learn what an f2.8 aperture does. Learn what an f16 aperture does. That's the power of using your camera. And at Creative Photo Academy, we've got the knowledge base to help you. We have the experience to give you the experiences. We have what it takes to teach you all this. I love it. So let's talk about the shot. ISO 400, f-stop 16, 14 millimeter lens, wide, wide angle. I've got the whole scene in front of me. At f16, it's all gonna be in focus. I could open the aperture and do a focus stack if I wanted. But I like the F16 look, the background's gonna be a little out of focus, it's awesome. With ISO 400, it's gonna give me a half of a second exposure. Camera on the tripod, using the touch shutter release, bong, it's done, I love it. So thanks for joining me today for day 121. We'll have another edition of the Be Creative series tomorrow. I hope you find a good picture today. I hope you find a great picture tomorrow and you share it with us, because I want to see it. Hashtag Paul's Photo, hashtag Creative Photo Academy, and hashtag We're All Together. Because sharing these pictures is what makes life worth living, and it's what's made the lockdown, being home, bearable. I love it, thank you very much. Thanks for coming out, thanks for watching, and we'll see you real soon on the Be Creative series tomorrow.